What in the world, Bo? My name is Big Low Country. First of all, y'all make sure y'all do a country boy a favor. Hit that subscribe button, man. I just want to talk to y'all about my grade for Mr. Jalen Mayfield. What in the world, Bo? So first of all, I didn't like the pick. I'm sorry. I didn't like the pick, Bo. Why didn't I like it? Because, first of all, I, I didn't like the second pick that they made with Richie Grant. And I'm thinking, okay, all right, coach, that's cool. We need to make sure that we take care of the, the, the front half of this defense. We need to take care of that front seven. So I'm thinking defense as far as that, as far as that third pick. So the Falcons, you know, they had the third pick, fourth pick in the third round, and they went with Jalen Mayfield. Now, the issue that I have with this is because all throughout the whole draft process, the thing that I kept hearing about Jalen Mayfield was developmental developmental one day he'll be a starter in the nfl one day he'll have the potential to be a starter in the nfl so he's a, he, he's an offensive tackle uh you know he played in michigan six five about 320 big boy but one of the biggest issues with him is he has short arms he has short arms great great at run blocking you know, he, he's a people mover, but when it comes to pass blocking, he gets eaten up a little bit. I think I heard that he was in like the 13th percentile. That's pretty low, you know, to be getting took in the third round. You know, we ain't trying to do the developmental thing, Bo. We trying to go ahead and win some games. So I'm going to go ahead and tell you. I'm going to go ahead and put it on out here. Terrifying. I know Arthur Smith, I got to give you a C. I got to give you a C, Bo. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Bo. What, what in the world, man? What in the world? So we get a guy, offensive tackle. He played right tackle in Michigan. He's 20 years old, so he's young. He could be developed sooner or later. But this defense was terrible last year, Bo. What in the world? What is we doing? What is we doing? Now, it would be different. Now, and, and think about this. Think about this. It would be completely different if they got Jalen Mayfield and he's just the aficionado a pass blocking. We say, okay, well, you know, we, if we're going to roll with Matt Ryan next year, let's take care of Matt Ryan. That's not the case. We got a guy who his bread and butter is just moving people off the line of scrimmage. Now, look, he runs that zone run blocking scheme pretty now. He 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 good at moving to the side and blocking people. I seen him do a good bit of pancaking in the Power Five conferences. Jalen Mayfield had the second most big time blocks in college football so that's telling me in the fact that he's 6'5 320 325 that's telling me that they're going to kick this kid inside to play guard he's going to be playing guard especially if he comes flashes and shows that he he's a, actually a good blocker in the nfl he has a chance to make some moves I legitimately think that he's going to be playing guard uh, for the Atlanta Falcons. Now, I, I mentioned this on, our, on my live stream. I said that, look, teams that win Super Bowls, their offensive line isn't just head and shoulders above everybody else's. You just need something serviceable. Last time the Falcons went to the Super Bowl, they had Wes Schweitzer and Chris Chester as their guards. Those aren't world beaters. Right now, what the Falcons need to be worried about is getting – some pressure on the other team's quarterback because they passed up on Joseph Asai, the defensive end from Texas. They passed up on my boy, Alim McNeil, the defensive tackle from North Carolina State. You know, they passed up on Chauncey Golston from Iowa. They passed up on, on Patrick Jones from Pittsburgh. What in the world, bro? What y'all doing, man? Look. I didn't like the pick, but I definitely hope that I'm wrong. Terrified. No, Arthur Smith, I got to give you a C on this one, Bo. I'm, I'm sorry. I got to give you a C. Hey, man, y'all make sure y'all do a country boy a favor. Hit that subscribe button, man. We get together. We talk about football all the time. Also, make sure that you comment. Tell me what grade you would give this pick, and I reply to all comments, man. What in the world, Bo?